Hello everybody, and we're about to continue our Let's Play series of Dragon Quest XI, Echoes of an Elusive Age. In our last episode, we discovered that Vince was actually working with a pretty bad enemy, a giant spider, and essentially trying to feed fighters to get benefit from the spider. So the spider would take the essence of the fighter, and then give a little bit of the power for Vince, because he was trying to keep the orphanage open. But we were able to defeat the spider, and kind of get justice to the area. Let's kind of see what is in store on our next episode here. I'm assuming it's something with at least getting the rainbow. I believe that is our prize. Okay, speak with the receptionist in the building at the back of Octagonia. is the receptionist. Head up to the arena right away. Okay. Alright everybody, it's time to bring this year's Masked Martial Arts Tournament to a close. It's prize giving time! Ladies and gentlemen, I give you our champions, the Invincibles! And now, to present the prize. Hold up! Hold up! Huh? Seems kind of a shame to have the good folks of Octagonia come out and support us and not give them a show to enjoy. Why don't we make this interesting? I challenge you to a fight for the prize, partner. Winner takes all! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the gauntlet has been thrown down! Now that's the stuff champions are made of! No backing out now, unless you want to ride on your hands. <laughs> Huh. Fooled ya. I don't do that stuff no more. I fight clean or not at all. Can you set some good news? Do this. <laughs> let's do this thing! Oh yeah! Okay, we're already pepped up, which is nice. <laughs> Pretty quick. <laughs> it's all over! The champ is down! We have a winner! Vince looked kind of weak out there. He sure did. What's gotten into him? I needed people to see that. To see that I ain't nothing without that juice. I never had what it takes to be the champ. You deserve that prize, man. Thanks. You taught me what it means to be a fighter again. I won't forget this time. We love you, Vince! Thanks for putting it on the line for us every time! You're a true champ, man! This, 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 this! 
<laughs> kind of a touching moment right there. It gives me great pleasure to announce that the winner of the rainbow is... This is bad. This is real bad. Huh? <sighs> it's the rainbow. It's gone. Of course. <gasps> and all there was instead was this. And this letter, too. Looks like it's for you. Come and meet me in Dundrasil. I've something to show you. Don't worry about the rainbow. It's safe with me. That's some good news, at least. What a shocking twist to end our tale, ladies and gentlemen. The grand prize snatched from under our champion's nose by none other than Old Man Rab! Will our hero journey to Dundrazil to claim what's rightfully his? How will it all end? I, for one, can't wait to find out! Dundrazil, huh? So it's back to where it all began. Hmm. Undisputed champion of Eridrea. Awarded for overcoming the reigning champion Vince Vanquish and claiming the crown of Master of the Masked Martial Arts Tournament. Okay, that is great. I believe we have a side quest over here. Fighting in the arena means performing in front of a crowd, and that means looking your best at all times. Bad skin's bad news out there in the ring. But keeping things blemish free ain't easy. We're getting punched in the face all day. Looks like we have a mission for skin care. Interesting. The fighter wants you to collect some Mellow Vera from a place by a waterfall near the ruins of Dundersil. Yeah, it sounds like a pretty straightforward request. So once we get back to Dundersil, we'll be able to take care of that. We have a little bit of exploring to do first. We did not head on over to this little corner over here. I think we went straight from we're in the Zwardrus region and we went straight to Octagonia. So we didn't explore any of that part leading back to Ruins of Dunder So we're going to be going this way. There's any items we can find. We've already taken out a hood enemy. Sparkly. Silver ore. Exactly which way we want to go here. Definitely not that way. Oh, got caught up. Interesting. Bye. 
Over here, right there, we go. Let's make our way over to Dundrasil near the ruins, I believe. over here real quick. Might be a secret spot actually. take out this enemy right here and maybe we can get that chest let's do this Savando's up to level 20. Usable when Savando is pepped up. Frizzwiz, that's pretty fun. I'm gonna save our points for now. Okay, let's see if we can go down here. Maybe not. Let's do this! Blocked our, blocked our way. Oh my goodness. Just flying around fast. I guess we'll take it for now.
here and we have to go that way. Silver ore. Back into the rain. there and a new fire can't see there's anything we can forge Okay, that would be pretty good for Eric. Okay, let's try the Batterfly Knife. Pretty good here. Awesome. Pretty cool looking knife, actually. Okay, let's try this mask. We should be pretty good now. If there's anything else that we haven't made. Which armor? I think we're okay. Transfer this on over to Eric. 
and we'll equip it. He's got much more damage now. And the malleable mask, let's transfer that on over to... I guess it's 104, 57, 61, 70. Let's give this to Veronica. This is a good stopping point for this episode. Oh, sometimes I'm going to play some type of horn. That's kind of fun. We are, let's see, heading for the Ruins of Dundrazil. I think we'll want to explore that completely in an extended episode. Just have a feeling that's going to be a pretty big episode. I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in, and we'll be talking again real soon.